because uh, flexing rerouting, you can see kind of kind of see it in the in the map. Let's say we'll do the classic uptown classic uptown route. It's a classic one, and we did a video about it as well, where you get some brain breaker, you get your kitchen knife for your twin sword, you get your running shoes, you get your home warmer or your bracelet, and you build a uh, classic uh, uptown build there for stabby stabby. And you will end up with a windbreaker armor, pretty much like this top one here, pretty much like this top one here. A windbreaker sheet armor build type. Battle suit more school base, but same thing. The steel chain over there, and you have the rubber over there. So rubber built into the battle suit, and steel chain built into the rocker jacket. So what's the pro what's the problem with a root? It's not a problem, but it becomes a problem as you grow up as a player. And as you grow up as a player, you kind of notice that your your root might be slow and you get uh, uh contest a lot. So it might be faster if you mm, the more you know craft, uh the more the more root you know, you'll be able to switch items around. So yeah, you probably watch a few video for root, and yeah, you can see. Oh, we'll probably be building those in uptown. I always build my four stopper. I always build my rocker jacket. I always build my maverick runner. But not always, because in the game, it might uh, it might change what you end up finding, and be able to switch things around. So that's why we are talking about this video because we did a lot of roots. We did a lot of beginner stuff. So. Uh, we want to go a little bit deeper because people might be willing to reach dragon and to reach dragon you have to be flexible <laughs> you have to learn to flex uh, for sure otherwise you'll never be dragon you only need well strat no well, this well strat is a root well strat is a root but you have to keep the spirit the spirit of well strat though if you keep the spirit the spirit of well strat you can do dragon yes the spirit of well strat is uh, starting there. Uh, you go with whatever you find first. So Alex Blix always build the claw. You know, he always, always wait for the claw. But you might find the knuckle first. And since I uh, uh, I might find the knuckle first, I will go with knuckle first. But I, Alex wouldn't do that though, <laughs> because uh, he waits for the claw. The claw is powerful, but it's slower if you find the knuckle first. Because you already found a weapon, and you could have been uh, somewhere else uh, with your knuckle uh, by moving somewhere else. That's one thing to uh, to notice. Because when you have a root, you kind of expect that you you want to you, to find the ex specifically claw, but knuckle is the end weapon as well. So it does not really matter which one the, you you go hot with. It will uh, because you can build them, but if you always go for something, you will uh, you will pass on items, and that's the thing with the difference between a root and a flexing. The flex guy they use whatever they find first, and the root guy they wait for the specific item they want, and waiting for the specific item is, is slower for sure. So the flex guy they come in a game with the knowledge of all the craft. Pretty much, because the more craft you know over here, uh, either weapon, gear, food, and normal, the more craft you know over here, the better you will be flexing. You will be able to do uh, to change the your build around. It's a uh, it's a learning process over time. That's for sure. I didn't learn all those craft in one day. <laughs> Uh, gradually, over time, by doing them, by adding more root, I started with root as well. So I had multiple roots, and I was like, oh, I couldn't get the the boots over there. So I had to switch uh, what what other boots that I can craft as well. So let's say in my uptown uptown route, I couldn't do the Maverick Runner because I couldn't get my running shoes. So I have I will have to get some other boots. So that's how I started to mix things around, right? Started to mix things around. Oh, I can do killer heels as well. I say if I find the slippers or in town hall or hospital, that's so that's also some boots I could be doing. I could use some cloth as well from the battle boots. I've been doing that on other builds. An, uh, another route was using battle boots, so we can switch 
we can combine multiple routes together, right? That's the flex way to doing things. And eventually, I kind of gave up uh, doing root at all. And that's when I reached Dragon. <laughs> when I gave up on root. <laughs> and I just go with whatever I find in the game first. Because that's the fastest. Uh, that's the fastest. And you have more time to build mastery. You have more time to fish more tuna. As we love uh, me and Alex with. We love our tuna. It's part of winning. <laughs> Yeah, you have to include that in your in your build, pretty much. Uh, uh, including a big eels, including big eels in your uh, in your build. So if you're not, if you didn't get any tree of life, because sometimes you don't get tree of life, so you'll have to include a tuna, potatoes, potato soy sauce, or uh, the scroll from a hospital, because those are the only ones that are not RNG. Otherwise, you'll have to do the fresh sashimi as well. So same thing when you search an area. Uh, when you find more food first, uh, it also means that you can build more mastery early game. And less armor, you'll have less armor, but you, can, you will be able to build more mastery because you found food first. So just like in the last game I'm playing, I don't do it all the time as well. I was waiting for the claw all day, every day. I was only looking for the claw, maybe. Maybe for the Buddhist scripture as well. I had a wooden fish, but... I was pretty much waiting. I had already the thick paper. I had already the hair hairband. I had already the long, the long spear already. So I had already a stone. So I I saw it pretty much everything here. So I should have I should have uh, been moving somewhere else. So somewhere like uh, I don't know. We have some clothing. We can build something else. We could be building into the the boots already, uh, because we have no boots over there in temple, unless we get we get some clothes which we didn't get because we were looking for that. But if we go over here, we might find a slipper, we can build on boots. And we have, uh, otherwise we have not much, uh, anything else, pretty much, uh, pretty much the same thing here. Flex is, uh, that's why it's an art, the art, the heart of flexing, because sometimes you're able to do it, sometimes I'm not able to do it. I don't do it all the time, but the people that does flexing the most, they are the better player. That's why people say that uh, when they play sometime off stream, uh, they do better job of uh, flexing than they play uh, on stream. I think that is also a part of that. That's uh, also a thing. Then they do be they do better off stream than on stream. But there's also that. It's a very it's a very flexing is uh, the magic of flexing is uh, it's a very magical thing. <laughs> if the is the magic over there will be over with you or not? So you have to. Uh, but when you start a game, sometimes you see the lobby and like, oh no, not this guy, this guy's always win, no, I can't do anything. So you kind of keep that in your mind and you will probably make a worse decision because you have, oh no, this guy is playing my game. So, I will, oh, so you will you make bet worse decision pretty much because you're distracted by something else. And that's pretty much it, right? The hell of flexing, but it's still, um, it's still a mystery for me. Kinda is because I'm not the I'm not the top top player, but I think uh, you have a good idea what uh, what it involves uh, with the craft, also uh, the importance of food as well, mm, and also the magic, right? You have those multiple area. Why do we stick here? Why don't we don't go? To, go? Why we don't we don't go for the animals? The animals is spawn, but we don't go for it. All those decisions that we don't make, uh, then we know it's our better, better decision, but it uh, keeps us uh, from making them. The magic. It's uh, it's the most fascinating topic for me. <laughs> maybe maybe it will help you to reach dragon on your home, but as a journey you have to go through. That's it, let's sign off, uh, until next time, bye bye.